Hi, I'm Katie Frades with Science on Demand. I am a disciple of Jesus Christ, a wife of almost 30 years, a homeschool mom of three girls for over 20 years, and I've had the great privilege of teaching creation science, the biblical scientific creation model of origins nationally for about the past 20 years now. I find it extremely important to build people's faith through teaching the science that supports the Bible just the way it's written. I've been teaching live science classes for over 20 years now to homeschoolers who have asked me to because my degree is in um, micro and cell biology, so I am actually a scientist by education and a creation scientist by call. And so I started, like I said, about 20 years ago teaching physical science, biology, and chemistry uh, using the Apologia textbooks, which I personally think are very good textbooks. And in that time period, I've lived several places in Florida. And as I left certain areas, parents were upset because they wanted their children to be able to continue taking my classes, but we were at too great a distance. And so as the technology increased, we were able to finally film our live classes and offer our classes online. Now the reason this is important to me, and the reason that we bothered to go through all this, because it has been difficult, but we have filmed the online classes, we have filmed the labs. When the labs weren't filmed in the classroom, we made sure we did the labs separately so that the online students could thoroughly benefit from this. And the reason that I do this is because I teach the science, which is my passion, let's be honest, I just love science and that's why you know I teach it because God called me into it. I actually get excited about it. I want the kids to have fun while they learn it. I've had a lot of kids that said they hated science but they actually enjoyed my classes. Praise the Lord. That is a God's blessing and that's what we want. We want your kids to get excited about studying God's creation. We want your kids to know that they can, that it's not beyond them, that it's within their reach. But above all, we want our children to know that they can trust that God's word is true. And as I teach it, I don't only teach the design features, I teach them how it fits into a young earth, the, the biblical young earth perspective. They learn the catastrophic plate tectonics model. They learn how the ice age fits in. They learn how fossils really fit in, how dinosaurs really fit in. They learn to actually be able to go to national parks, state parks, museums, and interpret what's there into a biblical worldview. Because that is my passion. That is my heart. My heart is to encourage your student while they're learning science. And I'd like them to learn good science. I'm a homeschool mom. I want them to a good job. But, and, and of course, we're Christian homeschoolers, so we have to do things with excellence. But the point is, above all, we want our pe young people to know that they can trust that God's word is true, every word in it, and that God didn't need scientists to tell him what he meant to say. He said it just the way he wanted it said. So as we study the stars and we study the solar system and we study microbes and we study all these different things, we actually are learning creation astronomy. We're learning creation apologetics is what I like to call it. We, I try to make sure that your students have a really strong foundation so that when they leave your tutelage, when they go out to be adults, that they really have the foundations that they need to be able to speak out boldly for the cause of Christ, that no matter what hits them in their academic or other life, that they will know that they can trust God's word to be true just the way it's written. And let's be honest, it's under attack constantly nowadays, and our children will be under that attack. And I've been blessed by parents telling me that students that have taken my science classes over the years and really have learned these things that I've tried to put into them have been able to answer questions that frequently even their parents are unable to answer and the, they're always very proud and that blesses me. This is what it's all about to me. It's about passing along the baton. It's about making sure our kids get a foundation in science, in science that's not only a great foundation so that they can go on to college and be nurses and doctors and whatever else that God calls them to be, but what about the ballerinas and the art majors? We still need our children to have a foundation in science that is within a biblical worldview so that when they're taking their kids to the museum or they're taking their kids to the park, no matter what they get hit with, they can answer 
those things. They know how they fit into a biblical worldview. They know why we see the variation that we do within people, and yet we all come from the sons of Noah. They, they, they understand that biblically. They understand why we see the things we see all around us every day. And so that's what I'm trying to accomplish with our online science classes. And then the benefit of those two, many, many, once again, I'm a homeschool mom. The benefit of that is some of your kids are gonna wanna go really fast. They're gonna wanna, wanna do physical science in just a couple months. They can with the online classes. They can go as fast as they want. And then some of our students are different learners. I have a different learner and, and I love, they're all precious, but God really taught me a lot with mine. And with the different learners, then they may need a little more time. They can watch the classes over and over if they want to. And I try to teach everything in a way that is as interesting as possible. Honestly, I'm not into the reproduction of an earthworm and the kids know it and we all get through it together. But, you know, I get very jazzed and excited about a lot of things that most people think are really weird because I really love science. And so hopefully that comes through to the children and my students tell me that they do. So. I just wanted to let you share a little bit of my heart with you, let you know why we bothered to offer these online classes. And I just pray that it's a blessing to you if you try it. So God bless you.